Can I do one of these where I walk up to it and it looks like I've just got here? I will actually, you're right. <clears throat> Hello. Let's go and string up a tarp and get some grub on the go because I'm famished. So this um, from the from the stately home, it's a National Trust Fine Products Award winning beef, no less. As per solidify just a little bit of coconut oil. Needs replenishing, I shall write that in my little notebook. Look at this, this is, looks like bluebell. Bluebells are coming through ever so, ever so slowly. Put on a fillet, mate. Let's get some eggs on. There we go, fillet steak with eggs. Woo. <laughs> Are you having it or not? Because I am. I'm having this. <laughs> right, let's have a look at this steak, eh? Focus, please. Mm. Medium, it's not medium rare. I would have liked it a little bit rarer, but that's one of them things. Oh my word.
Look at this, that's delicious. Oh, whoa. Mmm. Don't look at me. Should we dip it in an egg just because why not? I mean, it's cooked well, and the smoke gives it an amazing flavour. But they just—you can tell the quality of the of the meat is there. It's so tender and flavourful. <laughs> mm. Oh, and after the after a day on the tools. It is so welcome. Yeah, I've been working quite a bit. And there we go. Step. Nice natural curve. Can't talk for too long because customers are looking out the window. Uh, curved it round here. As you can see, and then gravel strip all the way around it. On my own, because I've been let down by everybody, so I've just been working on my own, trying to get this garden finished. And um, the customer said that the stately home that wasn't too far away sold the best beef. I was going to knock on the door and ask for some lab off. <laughs> I'm not. A farm shop. Ooh. Spring. Here we are, look, farm shop. Let's get in here. Is this uh, from? The estate? Yeah, right, okay. Sold. Got any ribeyes now? <laughs> this is all you've got here? It is at the moment, yes. On We've the site. Uh, no, I no, need it today. I'll take this. Okay. Thank you. All raised on site, so. I chucked my bag in this morning anticipating that I'd get, I'd crack on and get it done with an early start. I was out before it was even light. And I managed to get it done and I got uh, went to the stately home and got some meat and some free range eggs. <laughs> and I've come out to cook them up. And to have a little bit of a dunk. Oh we focus. Come on, there you are. Is it having you? Look at that. Charred on the outside and pink in the middle. It just melts. Are you having that? Mate, I'm having that. I wanted to do a wild swim in the hailstones. Come on. More flame, less smoke. There we go. Yeah, but it's turned out to be a beautiful day. While I was grafting, it was peeing it down. Last bit mate, oh, if you were here, I promise, and I swear I would give you it, I promise. Mm. Oh, mate, 
I mean, I've had steak and eggs before, it's a staple, but that was something else. Ladathon. I might be a bit loudathon to go for a Swimmington to be fair. I'm excited because I brought my gloves just to uh, help me old digits out. Cooking good in the woods it says. Not that it, I can't be. Focus you meh. Come on. Oh it's not. But it does say that. Dustin bushcrafttools.com It's just ash. It's just ash. There's nothing, nothing to burn here. It's wet. It's wet and it was in the bush box. <laughs> it has taken a beating though over the years. So, I'm going strong. I've had it about seven years, this thing. Ow, bollocks. Seven years of absolute... Well, I've beasted it. Should really do a review of it. After seven years, I'm probably qualified to have an opinion on it. Uh, there we go. Thank you. Mwah. Thank you, thank you. Nippy mate, it's cold just holding this thing. <laughs> Come on. Let's go and plunge the plum. The forecast was for hailstones. I was hoping to be in the water with the hailstones bouncing off the water, which is a little bit like um, me and the northern monk lads had it halfway up Ben Nevis going in the the lake up there, it was beautiful. Oh, we just swam out into the middle of the town. It's cold now. Okay, and uh, the rain was bouncing, and we fell on the frying pan on the bottom. I'm finding it hard to talk because I'm so cold. Yeah, I'm chatting. Woo! Oh, no. <laughs> That's top, top five things I've ever done that when we were in there. It was bouncing. Yeah. That was cool. I was hoping to recreate something like that, but <laughs> it seems to be delightful weather. Let's see if just wearing gloves helps me to stay in longer. I and mean, that's freezing. I'm not even gonna. Oh. All these trees I've got to get over. Over it. <laughs> it's a bit gnarly. Oh, bog myrtle, mate. <sighs> okay. All right, okay. Really cold on, whoo, on bits. That is the junk dunked. That was good for, um, for fingers and toes. That's all good, that. That was good. Just the old, uh, just me pecker. <laughs> oh, 
That was good. See how I'm not making a meal of it now? I quite like it. I like it, I like it a lot. Let's get out. See, that ain't W column. Well done, lads. Well done. Congrats. <laughs> Tell you what, Nobert. <laughs> Ow. Sorry for if it's been quite a generic uh, classic, this. Um, just cooking some up on the bush box and dunking my junk, but I like it, mate, and I needed to do it. I've been, I've been working a little bit harder than usual uh, recently, and I've been craving just to get out and dunk my junk and uh, do some outdoorsy stuff. So this has recharged my battery, ready to get back stuff back into work. Uh, yeah, and just thanks for... Thanks for watching and thanks to everyone for your patience and thanks for, to everyone for your support, it means a lot. Um. <laughs> that was a good one. My hands are freezing, I can't think properly, so. <sighs> Namaste. Take care of yourselves. Bye. I'm going this time, I'm definitely going. I am coming back. In fact, I'm just leaving camera there. I'll come get. I'm, I'm off. I'm off. Oh, that was a pointless, wasn't it? Love you. Bye.